Leslie, come back here, baby. It is a beautiful morning back in Melbourne, Florida. And look who's going potty! Ah! <laughs> he's like, I'm naked. <laughs> so he's potty training right now and he's doing so good. He let me know that he needed to go potty twice. This is the second time he's been on the potty and he went pee pee the first time and now he's going poopy. So that's good. So this morning I have an inspector coming to the house. I've been super busy because I've been trying to catch up with everything. Ooh. And so the inspector is coming this morning and he is gonna take a look at what's going on in the ceiling. So this is what he's gonna be looking at. It's actually, I know, it, it smells as bad as it looks. It is absolutely horrible. And obviously I don't feel safe um, anymore with the kids here until this is fixed. Um, Haley's bedroom is, it looks really bad, but I honestly don't think it's as bad as Brayden's whole ceiling because I think that is like black mold and it's through the entire ceiling and it actually is coming all the way up to here and you can tell it's like coming in to here. I think it's the entire upstairs. So the inspector's coming. He's gonna take a look at it. I know what he's gonna say. He's gonna say, wow. But we'll see. <laughs> um, so anyways, the kids and I are gonna have to find um, a temporary place to stay for a little bit until this is taken care of because honestly, we shouldn't even be in it here for as long as we have been. Um, and hopefully after the inspector comes, it'll just get, everything will just get done a lot faster um, than it's been going because I feel people have been taking their sweet ass time coming over here and taking a look and like, I've been sending them photos and stuff, but I don't think they think it's as bad as it really is. So I'm happy this is happening today. You can get it done and over with and hopefully everything gets taken care of because I'm done talking about it. Anyways, so Roman and I are gonna wait for the inspector to come and he better hurry because I'm hungry. And I know Roman's probably hungry too. And then um, I have to pick the kids up from school early because I have to take Brayden to get his feet x-rayed. Remember when I took him to the doctor's office and they were like, oh my. This is what we're looking at. Look at how his toe is like growing this way. It's not even straight. His toe is crooked. So we're gonna go get that x-rayed. And that's all I have so far. Oh, and I need to get cat food. Don't let me forget to get cat food. All right guys, so we have made it to the hospital for Brayden's x-ray. Guess what? Mommy, this is the place I was born. Even me! Yeah, this is the hospital you guys were born at. It's pretty was... cool. Well, this is uh, where they were born. Nice little sidewalk. Can I? Can no, I? no, no. We're on the concrete. No, please. I want. We it. don't want to drop. No, but we don't want to drop them on the concrete, Kesley. Then they'll have to go to the hospital where we are right now. No.
There's Brayden's foot. It is curving a little bit, isn't it? A bit there, but yeah. Can I have another cassette? Ooh, that one's a lot different. <laughs> so his. Doing good, Bob. So what was this one? So it's his bone. Daddy, oh, right. right. Mom, so tell us the story of That's that. A cat scan. What is it? It's kind of the same thing. So what it does? That takes pictures of your muscles. Wow. Yeah. It's pretty. It's a pretty big machine, huh? <laughs> He's fine. <laughs> is it funny? <laughs> <laughs> Just right right now. Mm -hmm. Keep cold. Cold, cold, cold. That's way too cold. So, we found out today after school that the kids got life somehow. And I'm pretty sure they got it at school because only the older kids have it, but Roman does not have it. So that's what we're trying to take care of right now. And hopefully we get it all because I'm not in the mood for this. So this is what I purchased right here to get rid of it. And it comes with this shampoo. And then this right here you put in after it's done. So basically, I guess you apply this to dry hair and get it all on the scalp, let it sit for 10 minutes, and then you put this in it. And then, of course, this is for to check and make sure. So let's make sure we get all this taken care of, right guys? I'll show you a quick clip of what, um, how we found it. Um, it's kind of gross. So if you're a little bit squeamish, squeamish, go watch it. Insert now. There's another one. Disgusting. That wasn't any. That was pieces of it because I killed it inside your hair. <laughs> Here's another one. You see that? Ew. Oh, I saw you take that out. Okay, well now that Kesley didn't even have lice, but now that that little program thing, whatever, is done, let me show you this huge lice bug. It's right there. It's huge. It's huge for a Okay, guys, so what I wanted to show you was the NYX stuff that I'm using on their hair instead of the other stuff because I just decided this stuff would work better. So I'm using this as well as the other stuff because of course I already used the other stuff. So um, this stuff seems to be working a lot better and um, it actually has like um, gel that um, conditions their hair as well. So you can go and it has a better comb to comb through their hair. So and it's got spray that you can spray things. This is what Brayden's hair looks right now. So, um, I'm not seeing anything. I've had this stuff sitting in their hair for a while now. I'm gonna rinse it out, and then I'm gonna put this gel in it, and hopefully we don't ever have to do this again. It's very, very complicated. Yeah. And now we're gonna have to clean the whole entire house. Yep, fun, fun. Don't you just love school? <laughs> <laughs>
Okay, so kids are ready for bed and I think they are clean. So I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog and I'll update you tomorrow on how everything went and stuff. But I'm exhausted, so I'm gonna end the vlog. If you liked it, go ahead and give us a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe down below for us and we'll see you later.